faces, worn out places, worn out faces, bright and early for the daily races. Going Egg and Athletic uh, TV on a uh, sad but momentous day. <laughs> the, uh, the first league defeat ever uh, as a club, um, so there's three happy chappies on the couch. Um, I'm going to go to the uh, the skipper and manager today, so a lot of this slate. Um, where did it all go wrong for you today, Stewie, in your opinion? On a personal note, it didn't go that wrong for me. But <laughs> Very true. as I'm captain and active manager, we did get harmed. <laughs> Fair or okay, I suppose. We didn't seem to fucking... Sorry. We didn't seem to play very well. I'm already going to put an edit on this, it'll be a lot of swearing, so you knock um, yourself out. It is a bad day, isn't it, to be fair. Um, we seem to get caught wrong side of the ball a few times. When you're 3-0 down after um, half an hour, and it probably should have been 5 or 6, you know, you're up against it. But we, you know, we did well to get back to 3 all, and then they scored a good goal, to be fair, the fourth. It was a good individual goal, and then the fifth goal was a bit of a debacle between Berno and uh, Daz, <laughs> one way or another. Um, but yeah, we, uh, we just didn't really play very well, did we? Simple as that. Well, I was going to say, say about it. coming to you, Dave, we'll go to you next. Um, the, uh, a, a good old cliche from the from the gaffer normally is six or seven of you have a, have a good game and uh, you'll give teams a good go. I, I don't think there were many people, bar maybe Stu and one or two others, uh, there weren't very many people that could say they had a top game today. Uh, that's true. Um, I, I thought we did okay going forward in the set. It, once we were 3-0 down, we sort of changed the way we played a bit. Um, the problem for me is we kept just flicking the ball aimlessly. The amount of people who just one touch would uh, just flick it on into a bit of space and we give it away and a lot of their goals came from breaks from when we had possession up in their half and to be fair they attacked very quickly. Um, I, you know, if you're going to lose, uh, you know, I'd rather lose to a good team. Um, if you're going to lose, lose big. Yeah, yeah, and uh, lots of improvement I think. Lots of people need to get to training this week and um, step it up. Yeah, as you said, um, a step up in pace and a step up in quality because there were a few uh, a few lax passes. Um, on to you, Burton, on that note. Um, <laughs> <laughs> just coincidentally, um, lax passes and, and as Dave said, um, some some poor touches. Um, but that's not been uh, a general thing for this season. It, 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 do you see it as a one-off or, or is uh, it something that we uh, need to improve? Yeah, I see it as a one-off. Really, they really did put us under pressure when we were in their half. Really. We, we got we got up to in probably about 10 15 yards from their box and then they seemed to just hunt in packs and kept nicking the ball and catching us the wrong side they were a decent side you know um, I can't believe that the league position that they're in is true uh, whether they bought a lot of players in the January market already or whether they've had a few people ill and away or anyone whatever. wants to buy Greg he's free <laughs> free transfer yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah no they were yeah you know you don't you pay to win and lose sometimes and they were a decent side and uh, yeah they I wanted it a bit more than we did. I think the word is clinical across the park, whether it's tackling, passing, finishing, um, yeah, whatever it is, we're just lacking some real intensity at the minute. I think because we've had an easy season up to now, uh, we've been pretty lazy and we need to step it up. Yeah, and, and as you said, the league position's probably a bit false for them. Um, for us, you know, do you, do you see us as a, a league position is, is about right for us? Or, yeah, you know, well, you know, we will be. We'll be at the end of the year if we continue to work hard if we play like that again we won't be um i think a true reflection of the league will be you know it'll be fought between us maybe mill me they've played a few more games and woken the horse probably and by the time that those that team <coughs> there goes on a run then you never know um but we we, we four, four points in hand i think still so it's hard to lose and um Got just, cramp in my toe. oh nice Ch changing tax slightly Stu, you're you're always uh, <coughs> And it hasn't happened for a while, this is why I worry about you. You, you don't take losing very well. Um, what have you got planned for the rest of the day? Because we need to just keep tabs on you. I don't know, well, it's probably not me you ought to worry about. You probably have to worry about Jess, I suppose. Um, <laughs> You'll beat her up again. I might. <laughs> Someone's going to get it. Um, no, traditionally I'm not a very good loser, as you know. <laughs> probably wasn't a good idea <laughs> putting me in this seat. Which makes it worse. Um, I thought you, it's like independence, you just talk it out. No. No? No, no. I can't believe we let him five goals, Paul. That's the problem. Should have yeah. been eight to work through all the saves. It's we very never true. play well when we don't have a gap and there's no gap. No to be honest, here, there so. is one other thing that needs to be brought up and I think is the biggest thing to blame today and that's the fact there were no sausage rolls at the end of the game. <laughs> um, no dog rolls, nothing to play for. It's very true. It's really <laughs> disappointing. Really disappointing. So. But, you know, saving the day, Dave, you have managed to find some amazing chocolate cake. 
Um, so yeah, happy weapon. birthday, young uh, Cade, who seemed to go off with a tight bottom. So <laughs> I don't know what he did for his uh, 18th birthday. Uh, I think he was in Woking with Powsen, so probably bum sex. That's it. Uh, so onwards and upwards uh, next week. Obviously, still uh, still a lot to play for. Still a cup to to play for and a league title. Um, obviously, there there is going to be a lot of effort to train. Hopefully, uh, that is so two league defeats or two defeats in a row, though. So we need to turn it around. Exactly that. So a message for for the fans who who might be a little bit worried on that note. There's only three of them. Uh, <laughs> my mum was here for the first time all season. Don't come again. Um, Steve, I think you need to give Russell a bit more of a hard time. Oh yeah, on, on one note, Russell's goal today was one of the best goals I've ever seen. Yeah, yeah that's great though, isn't it? But, you know, we lost. Yeah. Um, Getting five goals. Stick with us, goal, we'll, we'll get better. We're, yeah, so, so on that note, I, um, there, there, there isn't actually a, a Fez this week, um, because in honour of the fact that the Fez is still in Paddyland, uh, we thought we'd give it uh, a week off. But, um, this is the most random thing in the world, um, we've lost by... A massive margin in terms of quality. Um, we've conceded five goals. Our striker scored a worldie. Uh, we're all pissed off, and a goalie gets man of the match. Uh, so, uh, on that note, uh, congratulations to some worldie saves, Dewey, because you got man of the match. Uh, but there's nothing, nothing for you. So, uh, just a, a hearty pat on the back. Anything. Okay, fair enough. Uh, it would quite easily been 11 5 today if it wasn't for Stewie. I don't think Stewie would have cared anymore. Bring it in. Yeah, there we go. Good. Don't cry very often, but I might. <laughs> See you later, chat. Well, if you're going to cry or anything, that's the thing. <laughs>